Hello everyone. I'm very excited to share with you the Badgley Mishka Kiara Pump with a four and a half inch heel. If you love eccentricity, shimmer, and shine on your heels, then this just may be the next favorite shoe in your collection. Please go ahead and click the like and subscribe buttons. I must note that I am not being paid or sponsored and this review is my honest and personal review and opinion. I've seen these heels online for a while. I was wondering when I would click the button and I wanted to so bad. During Black Friday, I finally gave in, clicked the button and bought the heel. Once the purchase was made, I did begin pondering whether they could be as beautiful, elegant and gorgeous as they were in the pictures. Granted, the heels are moderately priced at approximately $245. I was definitely worried I would be left disappointed. The only way I was going to be able to know was to push that button and voila, they're here. Let's talk about the heel packaging. The first thing I noticed was the black and almond cardboard box in which they are packaged. It was a typical shoe box you'd find in a shoe store, so nothing special there. The one I did receive was slightly damaged on the corner, and I spec this is because of shipping, so no dings on the manufacturer, just putting it out there. Once I did open the box, there was replacement heel taps taped to the bottom of the box, as well as a small bag of replacement rhinestones for the heels, which was an added bonus and definitely something that you'll want to keep on hand. There was also a very lovely dust bag in the box that was the perfect size for storage or travel. The dust bag included the logo of the manufacturer and is comprised of a fleece-like material, making it an option for longer-term storage or to throw in your overnight bag, which was pretty nice. Each shoe was individually wrapped in tissue paper and covered with a larger set of branded tissue paper. Pretty nice there too. Quality. With regard to the quality and construction of the Kiara heels. They definitely are of a very high quality and you can see that in the material selection as well as the leathers for the soles. They are actually made in Italy by third and fourth generation shoemakers, which is pretty cool. And they do feature a single piece of leather on the sole. And when I looked at that originally, I didn't think it was a big deal, but the heel over time tends to get loose. I've had shoes where they were split pieces and these probably are pretty durable. Having that single piece of material for the sole will make them much easier to glide and dance across the dance floor. If you like to dance, these may be an option for you. I did truly love the detailing on the back of each heel. If you notice it, there's many smaller, different size rhinestones, as well as one very large round one, which I thought was pretty neat. The accents are of a high quality. They are secured well without any extra or noticeable accompaniments to the heel. Pretty nice from a design perspective because sometimes you'll find extra stitching or glue. In this case, they're sewn on, but there's not a lot of glue or other things to hold them in place. Craftsmanship. Upon first glance, they are beautiful. They're well-crafted and exquisitely made to last. The stitching is done with precision and with fine quality threading. There weren't any dangling pieces of thread hanging from the heels when they arrived, which you can sometimes find even on high-end heels. That was a positive alert or find. The Kiara heels did have a stunning silhouette and very luxurious accent. I was really impressed to admire the care that went into making the soles. They are crafted of a supple leather and included a metal brand plate in the middle of the shoe and it is visible when you're walking from behind. That was nice. Fit. When I tried these heels on, they did run a little small and I was about a half size larger on the pair that I ordered. They seemed to fit pretty well without having to force my foot in or stretch the shoe out. Something reminiscent of the glass slipper on Cinderella. The next thing of note is the peep toe opening. You notice the peep toe opening here. It is a pretty standard size for one to two toes. If you do have a longer second toe, it may rub on your toe or cause your toe to kind of hang over the the front of the shoe a little bit more than what you were thinking. I put this out there because it's something that I often forget about and when buying open toe heels it's a good thing to know. You don't want your feet to be too uncomfortable. The brand label that's placed inside the inner sole of the shoes. It reads Badgley Mishka 
and it's sewn in to the inner sole material pretty well without any sharp edges. So I thought that was pretty cool. You don't have to worry about blisters or anything right away. Durability. The number one question I ask every time I embark upon a new heel purchase is, how long will they last? These heels, they will last, but you must use caution to not walk on wet grass or spill beverages or other food items on them because they can stain and you wouldn't want these babies to be out of commission, not for one moment. So use caution. I was worried, I would say, about the snagging of the satin on the heel as well as the sides of the shoe from rubbing together, but the fabric seems to be pretty strong and appears to remain intact, as well as the rhinestones and accents on the spine of the shoe, so I'm not too worried about that. Style. The sapphire color is definitely very bubbly. It's a nice hue of blue, suitable for wearing to weddings, parties, social events, even on a daily basis if you're accustomed to wearing taller heels. These heels are a definite fashion statement. I mean, look at this. All the bling. Be cautious because you probably will turn into the center of attention just about anywhere you wear them. While the accents are a little flashy, they are done in a very elegant manner to not make them gaudy. Coolness. They are cool because they come in a variety of colors, make you feel like a princess the moment that they're placed on your feet and are not only gorgeous, but stylish and actually wearable just about anywhere. For me, the peep toe was a great addition and was icing on the purchase as well-fitting and looking peep toe shoes are usually very hard to find. These are the best wedding shoes I've seen all year. If you're looking for something blue, look no more. Versatility. Let's talk about that. When I look at these heels and think about all the places that they can be worn, it truly is limitless. They are of a high enough heel that you can wear them shopping on a date, to a wedding, even in a wedding party, as a bride, or to the movies, work, dancing, traveling. These heels are unique enough that they truly go anywhere you want them to comfort. I am sure you want to know if they are comfortable, right? Yes, they actually are extremely comfortable. And when you place them on your feet, it almost seems as if you're walking on tiny pillows. Seriously, the one inch platform is definitely supportive and doesn't feel absurdly high when standing. And amazingly, they were comfortable to wear from morning till night. The heels have an internal leather padding, though it is a little bit snug. If you size them correctly, you can avoid the numbness of the toes, the squeezing of the feet, and all the problems that come with wearing a shoe that's too tight. So I'd recommend making sure that you purchase the correct size or at least try them on before purchasing them so that you're not disappointed. Value. The Kiara heels are definitely a splurge and can often be found online from various retailers around the $245 a pair price range. They are a little bit on the pricier side, but may be a value for you. The quality, style, coolness, and comfort makes them a fairly good value. All in all, I absolutely love the variety of colors, the quality, craftsmanship, and overall value of the shoes, though I was disappointed at the durability and the package. Aside from the heels running small, having delicate satin outer material, I found the heels to be a great addition to my wardrobe. They are a fantastic option for the bride, wedding party, and special occasions. So if you have one coming up, you should consider the Kiara heels as your go-to option for style, classiness, and the OMG factor. The Kiara heels do come in approximately 10 different colors and satin materials and range in sizes from four and a half medium to 11 medium US, making them elegant, stylish, and a welcome addition to any wardrobe. Let's get to my heel review. For packaging, I gave them a five because they came in an ordinary box. While it did come with a dust bag, I wasn't overwhelmed. From a style perspective, I gave them a seven because these definitely are stylish. Quality, a seven as well. The keels are constructed and crafted very well. And the materials used for both the inner and upper are of a great quality and will last. Coolness. 
I gave these an eight. Who wouldn't give a shoe with this kind of a pizzazz an eight? This is definitely a cool shoe to wear. You will get the attention whether you want it or not. So for that, an eight it is. Craftsmanship. I gave the Kiara heels an eight because they are very well crafted. Fine materials, attention to details, and stability. Versatility. I gave the heels a six because while they can be worn to many places, they cannot be worn to every place. Based on the material and the fact that it can easily stain and potentially snag, seven for fit. Because they do fit pretty well, though I did have to go up a half a size, seven it is. Comfort. I gave the heels a seven because they are very comfortable considering it's a four and a half inch heel with a one inch platform. The interior of the shoes are padded very well at both the ball of the heel as well as the heel itself, making them enjoyable to wear. Durability. I gave the heels a five because they are made to last under certain care and maintenance. Finally, for value, I rated these heels a six because a $245 plus price tag isn't necessarily a value. There are comparable models of a lower price point that can be purchased online from various retailers for approximately $100 a pair. Are they made as well? Same quality level? No. But from a stance that this type of a heel may often be only worn once or twice, it may make sense for some buyers for a total of 66 points out of 100. Thanks again for joining me today to review the Badgley Mishka Kiara Heels in Sapphire. Not only were my concerns and doubts about purchasing these heels alleviated, but I was also glad I made the purchase. If you enjoyed tuning into my heel review and would like to see more, click the like and subscribe button so that you don't miss the next review. I post reviews every week and the next one is bound to be amazing. If these heels are for you, I am including a link in the description of where you can purchase them. Please comment below. There is a pair of heels you'd love to learn more about and you may see them on a future review. Until next time.